painting with Larry. This game is the bane of my existence. Jayski Bane, if you will. This game, um, just, I've been spending countless hours off screen trying to beat this thing. Can't beat it. But you know what? In this video, we're gonna beat it. It may not be today, it may not be tomorrow, but I'm gonna beat it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the thing I usually do, where I play the game for about 20, 30 minutes, and then we're just gonna cut straight to the ending, all right? I, I got the strat, I know what I'm doing. It all boils down to luck and muscle memory and do I make the right decisions. So here we go. I might make some stupid mistakes. We are not worrying about this intro. We're skipping all this. We're just going straight. We jump into the gameplay. We got to get this done, dude. I have gotten the alternate ending today. And well, I guess I can I not tell you that. I can't tell you that. That might be spoilers. Um, I don't know when this video is going up, but I've I've done a lot of stuff today. Okay, I've done a lot of hard stuff. I've done a lot of baldy related hard stuff today. And this is probably the hardest thing I've been attempting to do today. I'm not going to lie. It's been a pretty long recording session. Um, but we'll see. Maybe I'll get a first try. Maybe I won't. Maybe I just jinxed myself. I do know one thing. We're going to go by... We're going to step by step what I usually do in this game. That way you guys know. This is my strat. This may be good, may not be good. But the first thing we do is we go all the way in here. And we turn the switch right here. Bim. And that turns the laser thing, the laser security on floor five off. So once we're five out of six of these paint buckets, we don't have to worry about turning that off then. All right. The next thing we can do is we go to floor four, baby. The highest floor we can go to in the beginning because for some reason we can't go to floor five yet. This is, this is the thing. We can't go to floor five yet. It says we need to get the rest of the paint first. For some reason. There's paint up there, bro. I don't, I don't know what you're saying. So, enemy spawn. First thing we do is we bait him. Go right a little bit. Wait for him. And then we just go left. And we just spam click. Alright, and then we wait for him to go like maybe half out of the screen. And then we right click, get out, and just run right. And we can run straight down to the painting. And then come right back up. Um, my uh, The last time I got, re last time I got really, really far... And I got all the way to floor five and I got to where the paint bucket was in floor five, but I couldn't enter the room because I forgot to paint the exit. I was so mad at myself. Um, full disclosure, I just tried to record this and I did a whole video. <laughs> I edited it, I, I rendered it out, and I just didn't like it. I didn't like it, so um, I, I, we're scrapping it and we're doing this instead. I'm gonna beat it. I didn't beat it. And I was like, you know what guys, I'm done. And I was, ta I was talking mad shit, too. I wasn't, like, angry or salty or anything, but I was just like, this game's boring, man. You're boring. <laughs> it was mostly like, is it really worth it to beat it? And I was like, you know what? If you guys really want me to beat it in your hearts, like, if you really, 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 really want to see it, I'll do it, but you got to really show me. And I was like, yeah, get this video, give it a bunch of views, and I'll do it. But that's that's not, that's not how I roll. I don't want to do it like that. I don't want to just leave you guys one thing like that i should i should just deliver regardless you know um but don't get me wrong i i mean I, I i go for challenge games when i attempt them right but that doesn't mean i'm gonna try to beat every challenge in the world like dark souls no hit for example i'm not gonna be doing that on the channel you know i do hard games i play hard games i deep dive for secrets and stuff but i feel like i i have a breaking point and I have been, literally, you have not seen a video on this game for a month because I have been trying to beat it for a month. Um, and I'm able to beat Baldi's Basics mods in a few hours, you know? So, which that's another thing. Just because they're hard doesn't mean I have to do them. Like, Baldi's Basics mods, prime example. I shouldn't have to beat all those. It's just the same game over and over again. Y'all know I can beat Baldi's Basics. Y'all know. Y'all know I got this. Y'all know I got the knowledge, the know-how. I can do it. Anyway, I stopped telling you guys what we were doing. Basically, we went back up there, and then we went down there, and then we go up here to floor three, and then we, we go ahead and grab this. We got Tiny Larry. <sighs> the wrench in the plan. That's what Tiny Larry is. Tiny Larry makes the rest of the game so difficult. Go, go, go. Yeah, Tiny Larry makes the game very difficult. I, our main thing is we have to paint. 
So from here, we paint. And then we go left, and we go to the second floor. We might die here. This might be where we die. Let's go. Maybe we can get here before little Larry sees us. I think little Larry's on the floor too. No little Larry. You love to see it. And then we get out, and we get Robo Larry. And this is where Scary Larry often spawns on top of me. Very often. Very, very often. We should be good. As long as Scary Larry is not here. I don't have the paint, so we're good. Make sure nobody's down here. Okay, so now we just get the one on the bottom floor. And then we head up. It's not as I think it's the third door. It's the door after that. Yep. I got that. All right, cool. We have to paint. We have to paint. And then we head up. And this is hard. This is really hard. So now we, we go we go to floor five. I, I oh my god, this is scary. This is really difficult. So we have to paint here. And we're we're right where we were, right where we quit. That's scary, Larry. I don't want none, scary Larry. Going up. We gotta go right. We gotta go right. Scary Larry's down there. Scary Larry's the one that can outrun me. Everybody else I'm not as worried about. As long as I don't, like, dive into their face, you know? Or set myself up for failure with little Larry. Robo Larry should be here. Let's see who this is. Oh, we should just be able to go. Oh, I stunned. Okay, so we need to go right. We need to go right. Um, regular Larry is to the right. Let's bait him and- oh, that's not good. That can kill me. That can kill me. If I touch that, I die. <sighs> Alright, from here we just go right. That's locked. I can't go in there. Yes, paint. Black paint. I've never been- it says lucky. Oh, I've never been this far. This is as far as I've ever gotten. Get out. It is here. Hide, hide, hide. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Exit. Oh no. Why is it so d Um. Oh god. I can barely see that exclamation point. We have to go. We have to go. We have to go down. Is it everywhere? No shot, right? I can't run- I can't outrun that! Smile for her- no way. No. There's no way! You have to memorize that portion too- oh, okay, so now we know they outrun us. That outruns us. So we can bait on the ladders the same way I baited there. First try, we got further than I've ever gotten, which is crazy. Really crazy. So, and now we sh it should just, yep. <laughs> From the very beginning, dude. From the very beginning. Well, here we go again. See, this is why right here, dude, because that was so much effort. I know I probably made it look not hard, but it, trust me, it's hard. I can't believe that happened. Honestly, that might be easier than I think. I might just have to... God, where, what am I doing? Yeah, let's go up top. We go up top. Huh, <sighs> dude, my brain. Okay, so we go up top now. Okay, so we know there's one to the right when we go back down. We know how to bait on the ladder now. That's, that's a skill that I have acquired. I have learned how to do that. It's necessary for beating the game. That's as far as I've ever gotten. That's crazy. So crazy. Okay, so we bait him. God. That was insane. I I on it I did not see that coming. It's like a it's like a super Larry. So what do I just get to the exit then? Is there one on every floor? They just said it's here. I don't know. I have so many questions. 
the game got all staticky and it's gonna kill the bitrate of the video. <laughs> Cause it went all fetch in the forest. By the way, this is made by the same developer who made fetch in the forest. I, I don't know if you guys knew that. Um, but who buddy, this, this game is, it's rough. It's a tough one. It's very tough. Uh, all right, so we switched the the door off. We uh, or we switched the doors off. Yeah, we got the top far left one. I mean, as long as you know how to handle these, this AI is, and, they, and as long as they don't pincer you. Of course, you have to take a little bit of a leap of faith. You know, I mean, obvious. Like, there's no way I could have known that they were coming. For one, with the whole UI up, like with the with the static on screen. You getting closer? Yeah. With all that static on screen, there was no way for me to know if they were getting close before they actually got close. Because right here, on the top left, where it warns me, you can't really see it with that new overlay on. Makes it way harder to see. Okay, so we can just go. As long as Scary Larry doesn't, like, jump out in front of us, we're fine through the regular game. But everything else, we're gonna need... We're just gonna need to know where everybody is. And I think, I think that's just gonna come with a... Uh, waiting on the ladder territory. And I think we're just going to have bait on the ladder. Every single time. I think that's the strat to get back down is ladder baiting. So we will have to do that. And I think, like, once I get ladder baiting down, I think the only one who can jump down the ladder is uh, Tiny Larry or Little Larry or whatever he's called. So that's something... I'm gonna have to keep in mind and keep an eye out for. That's why it's so scary to do ladder, ladder baiting with the regular enemies, but that's why I'm not as afraid with this one. Now this one may be super fast, but I might be able to hide from it. I don't know. I don't even know if I can hide. Did it say can't hide? It probably did. I feel like I felt like I was moving super slow too. Though maybe it was just me. All right, second floor. We're three out of six. Should be Scary Larry here. Here they go, Scary Larry. We should just be able to go left. Nice. And then we got Robo Larry, which we might have to hide. Now, if we if we dodge Scary Larry like that, he should not spawn on top of me. Little Larry should be nearby, though. This was spooky. And Scary Larry is like right down here. But we're good. Okay. Scary Larry might have teleported. And then we just got the ground floor. And we just got to be really careful. So we're able to make it this far pretty consistently now. Or at least I feel like I am. I don't know. I still feel like it's luck. I still feel like a lot of it's luck. There's e roll Or i roll ye roll It's Larry spelled backwards. That's what it is. All right, one more. One more. We just got to make it up top. There's Scary Larry. Goodbye, Scary Larry. Go, go, go. We got to go. Are we getting closer or further? Okay. There is someone here. We're just going to go. I'm just going to go right. <sighs> now I got to get up. I got to get up top. I don't know where little tiny Larry is. Tiny, small, little Larry guy. I know we got Robo Larry straight ahead. I might be able to just go. I'm stunned, but it's okay. Okay, so we have... <sighs> yep, that's okay. I just don't want you to poop on me. Just don't poop on me and we're good. So we're ladder baiting now. That's what we're doing. It's so fucked. There was one on top and one below me. One on top and one below me. There's nothing I could have done there. That was just that was just fucked. So I need to to ladder bait. I need to alternate between both ladders and have their AI reset because if they the AI loses sight of you, it'll go the opposite direction, or at least from what I've seen. So I need to I need to alternate both ladders because what I was doing is I was camping the top ladder way too much, and that that was my downfall because I I was neglecting um I was neglecting Robo Larry, so Robo Larry snuck up on me there. Otherwise, we're solid. Otherwise, we're solid. So I'm starting to get to where I know the game well enough 
to where I can just I can confidently move through everything in the level each phase so I'm starting to I'm starting to get it it's starting to click and the more that clicks the more guaranteed we are to beat it because this is one of those games to where like if you know you know and I think that is a really big thing with like developers because obviously the developer made this game so the developer knows so the developer doesn't know it's an extremely difficult game because they know exactly what to do in what situation and where a every AI is going to be how they act they literally program them so um, I run into that too with development that's why my earlier games are so difficult is because I'm like they're not that hard because <laughs> I try to make games a challenge for myself and in order to make a challenge for yourself as a game developer you got to make the AI unpredictable and that's just it gets to the point where it's almost not fun for a player I'm not saying this game is, I mean, this game, honestly, at this point, isn't fun for me. Because I've been doing it. It's, it's like, I don't know. I've been doing it for so long. <laughs> then I'm just like, no, just let it be over. Not gonna lie, I got really nervous. And I was like, I, 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 I pretty much knew that I was gonna die when I got the, when I got the last thing of paint. Like, I knew I was gonna die. Because I didn't know what was coming. I didn't know what was ahead. I just didn't know. Now, I don't know. Yeah, okay. Here comes Larry. Okay, so he's going back. We just got to be careful, not get too close. He's going the other way. Nice. Nice. Let's get out. But yeah, you know, we out here. I'm doing my best. It's a memorization game, I feel like. I feel like... Okay, no. The best comparison I think I've... E oh, yeah. Peepaw. It's Peepaw. It's people. It's a memorization game, but it's a memorization with the AI as well on top of the item locations. Yep, it's a hundred percent peepaw, dude. This game is peepaw, but with peepaw, it was um, the AI was a lot less predictable. This AI is at least a little predictable. The AI and peepaw is just nutty, dude. He'll literally spawn on top of you. That's why every time an AI spawns on top of me in a game, I'm like, oh, he peepawed me, you know? And now it's become like a a term amongst us uh, low-poly developers. Or the cartoon poly. How do I classify us? Me, Dave, and Padre, basically. We say it's peepawing. Get peepawed. And things spawn on top of you. So yeah, there's there's that. The origin of that. Uh, Peepaw is a lot shorter of a game, though, and you can move through it a lot faster, so it's a lot less, like, daunting. Don't get me wrong, when I first beat it, it was nuts. I was like, what the fuck? How do I do this? Scary Larry. Wait for Scary Larry. Then we just go. Should be able to just go. Okay, Scary Larry should be pretty far away. Now, when we come out, we're going to want to immediately jump into this trash can because we're really far to the right. Yep. Let me just wait. All right, there we go. Avoid Scary Larry. Hopefully, Scary Larry's not over here. This is this always like scares the shit out of me. Scary Larry is very scary, as his name suggests. All right, we just gotta get the bottom floor, and then we climb all the way to the top, and then we we try to ladder juke everybody. I just gotta make sure I do it right. It's it still makes me really nervous because it's it's really tough to do it. Because you still get shot, you still get stunned, no matter what. So this should be scary, Larry, here. I just gotta be confident. I gotta be confident. I gotta be confident. I gotta walk with confidence. Scary, Larry. Let me go. We should be able to just go. And just go straight up. Yeah, there's somebody, but I don't care. And we should be able to just go straight up to the next floor from here. And from here, we have Robo Larry. But the faster we get there, the more likely we are to just be able to go. So I want to see if I can just go. And if not, I should be able to outrun Robo Larry. I can just go. Okay, we're good. Robo Larry is going to take a while to cycle back. We just keep resetting him. Basically, just go back and forth. Okay, Robo Larry's reset. Nice. Should be able to just go up now. 
I think it was the third one. Okay, here we go. We got the black one again. We get to the exit. I'm so slow. You're getting closer. Watch that exclamation point. All right, we need to go. <sighs> All right, we're baiting. We're baiting, it's fine. Spawns on the floor you're on. How am I supposed to do this? I see, I see, I see. It's so fast, you don't even have enough time to climb up the ladder, dude. That's too fast, developer. That's insane. That's actually insane. Come on, dude. Usually, I don't... I, I usually... I usually don't go this far with... Like, I, I usually don't talk shit. I, I'm tr you It's hard. It's hard not to. It's really hard not to. This is... It's okay. It's okay. You know what? Here. I'm gonna give me a drink of water. We're gonna sit for a second in this electrical room while I drink some water. Sorry, making really weird mouth noises. Okay. This game is very unbalanced. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I don't like the idea. I've never, ever liked the idea of having to memorize a game in order to beat it. Especially one with this much trial and error. This is this game is just the definition of trial and error, man. And the fact that every time you attempt, you have to go all the way back to the start, which usually I'm fine about, you know, whatever. But when it's this tedious and it's this like you do the same thing over and over, like this game you saw you've seen like my movements basically been the same every single time now i know i sit a little higher on the ladder but if i walk too far up the ladder the enemy will despawn so i'm th i i want to say i'd had to book it to the trash but you get outran so i don't even know how or if it's even possible to get through that last section because they despawn and respawn so you can't la you can't you literally can't ladder juke there was a fail safe for that programmed into the game so you cannot ladder juke it's one ai that spawns it respawns <laughs> on every floor that's insanity to me so now we have to figure out what we can do, where we can go, do we hesitate, do we just run? And it's just gonna be, we're just gonna have to go with it. We can't just trial and error it anymore. We have to just run for it when we get to that last phase. So when I get to that last phase, I'm gonna have to book it to that trash can there. And hope that somehow the AI hasn't gotten to that trash can before me. I don't think it's gonna work. I think you have to do like the ladder juke and figure out something i don't even know because the other trash cans on the very far left and there's no way in hell you're outrunning that so the only thing i can think of is either to book it to that first trash can or 
I don't even know. E either book it to that first trash can, or you got a you got a ladder. You got a ladder juke. Like there's there's no other way. And I feel like the ladder juke is a borderline exploit. So it has to be. It just runs straight. It has to be, unless the developer straight up did not test it, which. I, I don't think the developer didn't not test it. I'm pretty sure the developer tested their game. Most developers test their own games. I think I don't think this is an issue of not testing. I think this is an issue of uh, the developer knowing the game inside and out and just assuming that everybody else can do it easily, you know? Because I, I almost guarantee you the developer can beat this every single time. This is the kind of game that the developer can beat every single time if they have all these movements memorized. You know, all, that's all you need. You just need to have everything memorized. And I'll say that a thousand times. Because everything's consistent. Even even that last AI that spawns. I'm able to, I'm able to talk your guys' heads off right now. <laughs> and still do this. Alright, so we get up here. I think we're waiting. Are we waiting or are we just going? Oh, we wait, we wait, we wait. Little Larry. <laughs> no! God, he me. Did you see that? Come on, dude. I couldn't remember what to do there. I think we were too slow. I think we're supposed to just go. I think we got there too slow is what happened. Damn, dude. Oh, and see, just like that, we're back at the beginning again. All over again. Just, it's a lot of pain. It's a lot of pain. This is why in my first video that I just scrapped, I was like, hey guys, listen. If you guys really, 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 really want to see this, show me that you really, really, really want to see it because this is not feeling like it's worth it. And it's still not, dude. <laughs> like, doing it right now, it's still not. Like, I finished my recording session, started rendering out all these videos, and then I was like, no. I, 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 I hopped in the shower and I was taking a shower and I was like, no, dude. I... I gotta at least give it- I gotta at least give it the old college try. Like, I mean, I gave it the old college try. Like, like I said, I've been playing this game for like a month, but... My god, dude. Like, on and off. Like, obviously I haven't been like, crunching this game every day, all day, you know? It's been like an hour here and there, like, every week or so, you know? Like, it's not like I've been like, I gotta be painting with Larry, you know? <laughs> But it, I've been working on it, man. I really have. I want it. I want this. I want this game done. I want it. And it's not even like I. It's not even that I want the bragging rights to have beaten it. It's really strange. It's more like I don't want to attempt a challenge and not finish the challenge. It's not even like I'm like, oh yeah, well I beat a uh, painting with Larry. I'm probably never gonna talk about painting with Larry after it's over. As, as fucked up, up as that sounds, it's it's probably true. I'm probably going to be like, man, remember that painting with Larry game? That's crazy. It's basically Peepaw. I guess I would be talking about it technically. But you know what I mean. You know what I'm trying to say. Come on, Larry. Yeah, it's really hard. It's really hard to tell. And I got, I, I'm going to have to read that last AI and figure out what's going on. So I think the best way to do it is just to enter as far from as far right as possible in a lot of these and just go straight down. And uh, with Robo Larry, just... I've, I've noticed all the AI go left. Like, they go all the way far left. Like, that's how their AI resets when they see you. And then they don't see you anymore. They just move to the far left side of the map. And little Larry's the only one that like chases you down the ladder. Because I guess he can fit. <laughs> Up? Oh god, I don't remember. I'm losing my mind. Yeah, we go straight up. We go straight up. Oh, I clicked off the screen and I'm walking to the right. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. My controls are locked. My controls got locked for a second. <laughs> you guys saw my taskbar. Oh, no. No, no. All right, so Scary Larry is very scary. 
Because Scary Larry is faster than we are. There goes Scary Larry. We're good to go. Pretty much as soon as Scary Larry is off the screen, I book it. Wait. No. No, 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 no. What am I doing? Oh my god. I'm losing my mind. I'm actually losing my mind. Yep. Yep. That's what happens when you don't do things exactly the way they need to be done. <sighs> Alright, so. From this point in the video, we will be cutting to the winning run. Uh, it may not be today. I may be wearing a different shirt. But I've recorded as much as I can. I've shown as much progress as I can. The rest of this is just getting through that last portion of the game. You guys will see the entire winning run. Or you'll see me give up and ask you guys if you really, really think it's worth it and want to see it. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. All right, new strategy. I have it all written down. It's a memorization game. I have it all written down. The only variance is sometimes if I get floor two before floor one, Little Larry will tag team with Robo Larry and get me. I actually got to hit this electrical. It happened like three or four times. And I don't know why. So. I think I have a, a different plan that will work pretty much the same. So we'll see. <clears throat> we will see. I'm really quiet because I'm tryharding. And I'm, I don't know. If, I, I'm not going to waste my voice talking really loud because I don't know if I'm going to have to scrap this or not. Because I'm only keeping one run. So if you guys hear this, congratulations. If not, then... I guess you didn't. <laughs> cool. So we bait Larry left, then we bait him right. Nice. And then we paint one. See, there's trash here on floor three. And we just follow, and we might have to hide in this trash too. And then floor two, there's trash there. Yep. Okay. I think just hiding in trash is good in general. Alright, so now we go to floor four, right? Sorry, I'm trying to I'm trying to map out in my head like how each of that unknown Larry. I don't know what to call her. It just said smile for her, so I don't I don't know. I don't know what to call this AI, but this last AI. I'm trying to think of how to make it work. Right now I have hide in floor five trash, follow them and rush to floor four trash, hide in floor three trash, wait for her and follow, then hide in floor two trash. Or I could just rush to the left and hide in floor four trash there and then follow them. I don't know, man. Lots of hiding in trash. If rushing to the trash on the right doesn't work, which I don't think it's going to. All right, so now floor three. If rushing to the right doesn't work, then we rush to the left. Which part of me kind of, kind of wants to rush to the left, but that's such a far run. So I don't know. They're both, it's both real. It, they're, it's tough. I think what we do is instead of rushing to floor four trash, we rush left. And then get into the trash on the far left. And then we follow the AI. And then we rush floor. F I need to focus. Hi, 
high from Robo Larry. Yep. Oh, the stuns. Should be able to just follow right behind and then hide from little Larry. Little Larry fell downstairs. <sighs> okay. Paint five and then floor five ladder juke. That's it. Floor five ladder juke time. You just gotta get there. Definitely need to write that down. Should be able to just go straight up because I think Little Larry and Robo Larry are on the top now. Of course, we're gonna have to juke Little Larry when we see him. Ladder juke, ladder juke. I think we, yeah, I think when we drop off, we go left. We should be good. We should be able to just go. Hide in trash. We just hide. And if they overlap with trash, this is where we find out if they kill us, if they touch us in the trash. So we'll see. You seem to move really fast, so. All right, here we go, about to find out. You don't, nice. So we gotta follow right behind you then. Dude, that's terrifying. God, you move so slow. right behind you you don't move faster than her so it's okay trash nice and we just wait for you to be long gone You're long gone. Okay, so now we hide in the floor three trash. Yep, and we just keep following behind. gonna wait here wait for them to go left I guess here for you guys <sighs> oh my god dude I'm just waiting I'm not playing this game I know you're here Yep, you're coming. I 
know you're coming. Wait, what? Clicking like a madman, dude. Yes. I'm being as stealthy as I can, dude. Okay, we go down. Yes, go left. And then we go right. Yeah, we just wait. I'm just waiting because he's they're to the right. Oh, come on. Oh! No fucking way. No fucking way. Painting with Larry, baby. No way, dude. That's how you do it. Yes, that's, I don't care, it's worth it. Holy shit, dude. What a game. What a game. Painting with, La painting with Larry. Who knew? Dude, that was tough. That was very peephaw, but without them spawning on top of you, you had to memorize the whole thing. I have a whole list here. It says electrical, floor four left, bait berry left, bait berry right. Paint one, floor four right, paint two, floor three, paint three, floor one, hide from Robo Larry, paint four, go right behind Scary Larry and dodge little Larry, floor two, paint five, floor five, ladder juke both to left, <laughs> floor five right, hide in floor five trash, follow question, 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 and rush to floor four trash, which I went left, waited, and then went right, and I just basically waited and followed behind every floor till the exit. That's how you do it. That's Painting with Larry. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for motivating me to do this challenge because I literally just recorded a whole ass video on this and I gave up and I was like, nah, I can't, I can't just give up. And then here we are, here we are. Painting with Larry, done. Challenge complete. What now? What now universe? I haven't seen anybody else beat this, by the way, so I'm, I'm really excited. Like, I don't I don't know. Like, I know this isn't really something like bright, like, oh, I beat Brady Larry, but, you know, it's cool. I find, I, I feel like I, this was a series I just had hanging over my head for like a month, and I was just like, oh my god, I gotta go back to painting with Larry. I gotta go back to painting with Larry. Finally. I still don't know what's in the basement, though. I feel like we could have gone instead of going to the actual exit door. But nah, dude. I'm happy with this, and I don't think I'm going to have to come back to this game. Um, I also heard rumors that the developer of this game, same developer of this game is the developer of Fetch in the Forest, is releasing another game soon. So, yeah, I know. I know. I'm excited. But yeah, that was Painting with Larry. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know it's a longer video, and today was a double upload, but I, I really, really appreciate you guys. You guys have been on a roll watching my videos lately, and it's super cool. Super cool. Oh my god, I love you guys so much. You're so awesome. Bye.